G'day guys, we have got a 2008 Hilux in today, 2.7 litre petrol. It's uh, some, previously been diagnosed by someone else as a blown head gasket. The vehicle still runs, it got towed into us, so what we're going to do is we're going to try and prove this 100%. We obviously want to do our own diagnosis to confirm it's definitely got a blown head gasket or not. So what we're going to do is we're going to set up the scope. We've already set up what we're doing there with the pressure pulse sensor. We've got that connected to the radiator cap. We've got an ignition sink of cylinder one, and we're gonna set up the Pico. We're gonna run it, and we're gonna see if we get pressure spikes. So, let's test that out. All right, let's zoom in on that and have a look. Okay, get a little capture down here. We'll spread that out a bit. You can already see huge pulses here just after cylinder one sink. Right there, right there, right there, a little bit low there. So this has definitely got a blown head gasket. That's combustion pressure going through the cooling system. Now, if you haven't used one of these pressure pulse sensors before and you don't believe us, what we're going to do is we are going to do a cylinder leak down test on the engine and we're going to prove it 100% to you. So we'll set that up and we'll go from there. We have got the cylinder leak down tester connected up in cylinder one. We've put a rubber glove on the radiator cap for the cooling system. We're going to plug the cylinder leak down we're going to have a look at the loss on the gauge and then we're going to have a look at this little glove and see what happens. As you can see, massive loss right there. Let's have a look at what happens to the glove. It's a beautiful thing to look at. Just waiting for that. Well, as you can see guys, heaps of pressure in that cooling system blowing that glove right up. So it just goes to show that five minutes diagnosis with a pressure pulse sensor can prove that cooling system head gasket leak, saves you mucking around with the TK tester, getting the vehicle hot, holding it on top of the radiator. And yeah, something simple you can do with a very simple and cheap device. Thanks for watching guys. Please like and subscribe. Top blokes, cheers.